Although the federal government says it knows highly placed persons financing terrorism, a security expert is of the opinion that the inclusion of six Nigerians in the global terrorism sponsor list implies that the government is not proactive. Mercy Abokbo captures the opinion of security experts in this report. Activities of terrorism are worsening in Nigeria as funding and sponsors of the insurgents remain largely unknown by security agencies, apart from statements from government quarters alleging knowledge of such. A security expert, Yahuze Getso, who was a guest on The Breakfast on PLOS TV Africa, believes the government is not doing much in this slide. Yes, of course, Nigerian government was a bit relaxed uh, because they have not done their homework. Had it been they have done their homework, uh, they, they could have arrested them long before now. And um, the list could have been shared with the international community, not to wait until the United Arab Emirates sharing the list and um, uh, declaring them wanted. This is an slap. Uh, it's a diplomatic slap. It's a security slap. And uh, it exposes the weakness of our intelligence. And it also exposes the weakness of Nigeria's uh, 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 investigation procedure. And also, it uh, also exposes the weakness of Nigeria's capability. He says the government needs to collaborate with the government of the United Arab Emirates and orders to fight terrorism in Nigeria. Uh, it depends on the agreement, uh, the, 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 the memorandum of understanding as far as uh, persecution is concerned uh, of a criminal, Nigerian criminal found uh, who committed an offence in the UAE or who committed an offence in Nigeria or a UAE uh, indigent uh, that who may be committing an offence in Nigeria. So it all depends on what we have on the memorandum of understanding. Another analyst, Tony Foyeto, says government has the intelligence on terrorists and those funding the activities in Nigeria, but needs to be decisive and deliberate. If behave on the president, do not go beyond, you know, the rhetorics, go beyond, you know, all these things, and take decisive action against those that have been indicted, those that have been fingered. Forget about whether they have different religious faith with you. Forget about whether they have different tribe with you. Forget about whether they have different political, uh, uh, political alignments with you. And let the law take its course. Meanwhile, the Nigerians included in the global terror list by the UAE were arrested in 2017 and prosecuted in 2020 with a 10-year sentence each. Messi Boko for PLOS TV Africa. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.